Welcome. In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy A03 and today I will show you how you can hard reset this phone through recovery mode. Now, before I get started, I'm gonna mention that uh, when you perform this kind of reset of the device, in order to, as an example, and the reason I'm showing this, to remove a screen lock, if you don't know the screen lock, you get to remove it, but later on after the reset is finished, you will also be forced to uh, most certainly provide a verification that this device was yours by doing, uh, or by providing either the previously set screen lock or logged in account, either Google or Samsung One. If Samsung account was present on this device, it's gonna prioritize that. But if you had no Samsung account and only Google One, then it will uh, use Google uh, as the only method, obviously. Now, um, typically I would be also making later on a video on how we can bypass this kind of verification, but unfortunately at the time of recording this video, uh, I haven't found any uh, with the new security update on these devices, uh, on specifically Samsung's. So at the time of recording this, there is no way that I know of that will allow you to bypass this. So uh, just know that if you do this because you don't know your screen lock and for some reason you don't know your account, like either Google or Samsung, uh, then the device will effectively become a brick. Um, so anyway, I'm gonna now start this. So for this, we will need a cable. Uh, it needs to be plugged into your computer and we can connect it right away. There we go. It is charging, but I didn't hear anything from my computer, which is a little bit odd. I'm just gonna ignore it. It is connected to it, so it should work. Now, I'm gonna lock the device because typically if you have a screen lock, you won't be able to turn off the device in a normal way as uh, well, holding the power button like this and selecting power off. So uh, if you try to, it will tell you to put in a screen lock. So what you need to do is hold power key and the volume down. At the same time, interact with the display. So you wanna just touch it so it won't time out. And once it actually goes black when you're interacting with it, it means that the device turned off. At which point you want to switch from volume down to volume up. So now I'm gonna show you. So we're gonna hold power key volume down. Come on. I think I was holding the buttons a little bit not hard enough. There we go. So it just turned off. So I'm switching to volume up now. Oh. I think I held for just a little bit too long. Samsung Galaxy. Let go of the power key once you see the Galaxy. There we go. Now, as you can see, it boots us into recovery mode. So in here, uh, using a volume keys, you want to select wipe data factory reset. Hopefully you can see this. I guess when it's gonna be selected, it's gonna be a little bit uh, easier to see. As you can see now, wipe data factory reset. So you, like I said, use volume keys to select it. And then once it's selected, confirm it with power key. And select the second option, factory data reset, the same way as before. So say at the bottom formatting data and in a moment it should say data wipe complete at which point reboot system now will be selected by default so all you will need to do is press power button to initiate that reboot and the process will continue in the background well, factory resetting the device and once it's fully completed from it there we go uh, once it's fully completed we'll then be presented with android setup screen so i'll be back once that is visible and additionally we can also unplug the cable. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.